I was never interested in fancy knitting. I was only interested in knitting as a vehicle for using color. On the train back to London from visiting Scotland, there was a woman with our group and I said to her, do you know how to knit? And uh, she said, sure, I can teach you how to knit. And she taught me, it took about 20 minutes to learn on that train. And by the time I got to London, I had knitted a small piece of knitting and I was so excited how to use these beautiful colors uh, that I absolutely leapt off the train and went and bought myself a little pattern and sat down and made my first jumper. It was very badly made, but I was thrilled with it. I took it straight to Vogue magazine and they said, this is very, very exciting. This is where knitting is going in the future. And so a career just unfolded. Color is the wonderful extravagance we can afford ourselves. We can make things as colorful as we want if we're going to make it by hand. There's no point in baking white bread. I would say if, if you want a, a real turn on, travel and keep your eyes open and go to the museums and go to the antique shops and go to the shopping malls and just look at what fashions people have and what fabrics are in the shirts and the stockings and everything. You know, everything is grist to your mill as a designer. I would say, as a general rule of thumb, try not to be afraid of color and try to do, to express yourself with the color that really makes you happy, not what you think is in fashion. There's no rules, just take what you really like. Uh, in some of my workshops sometimes people say, oh, I'm working with these colors, I hate them, but I thought it was good for me to work with colors that I don't like. Um, not at all, go for what you love. You don't have to make something that's the, going to be absolutely in a museum or the answer to every problem of design. You just make something that makes you happy for a minute. And if it's a disaster, toss it in the wastebasket or give it to someone you don't like. And, you know, get on to another project. Just keep playing and experimenting. That's all we do as designers.